Hello again, everyone, and welcome to a bonus episode of Let's Play Pokemon Yellow, Gimmick Style Nuzlocke Challenge. We've already beaten the game, we've overcome the Elite Four, and we are now Pokemon League Champions. So, what is there left to do? Well, there's still a bunch of things we can do. We can still go out and collect all the Pokemon that we can find in the game. And since we've beaten the Elite Four, we've unlocked a very special area of the game that you can only get to at this point of the game. Right now we're back in Pallet Town. This is where we start after we defeat the Elite Four. We have all our Pokemon that we had def uh, defeated the Elite Four with, but I took a moment to switch our team up a little bit. We have all three of our legendary birds. Olga the Articuno, Maxwell the Zapdos, and Kenmore the Moltres. We're going to take our three legendary birds to go get the most legendary Pokemon of them all. And to get them, we have to go to Cerulean City. This may be a lot for you to remember, but way, way back when we first visited Cerulean City, maybe not when we first visited, but when we were visiting, there was a little area of grass and some water that we couldn't get past yet. But now, we should be able to. I'm just gonna jump on Nessie here. Hello. I hid because the people on the bridge scared me. No, well, that's all right. They're intimidating. We follow this little waterway. We come across this cave. Now, if I remember, there's also something worthwhile to grab over here. No, oh, but there is a trainer. I came to get my mushroom Pokemon. Alright, lass, bring it on. Oh, you're poor Paris. No match for my iceberg. I've taken the time to level them up a little bit, so they'll be strong enough to handle what's going on in that cave. Mushroom Pokemon. There might not be any more mushrooms here. I think I got them all. But what we want to do is go in here. This is the unknown dungeon. And in here, we can fight some of the most powerful Pokemon there are. I actually don't know my way around this dungeon, so we're just going to have fun. We're, we're going to treat it like we treat any other dungeon, though. I don't get to leave until we get to the end of it, or I use something to get me out. We can also catch a Pokemon here if we happen to come across one that I think I want, but we still apply the same rules. It has to be the first one I find, or I get none. And I don't have to catch ones that are part of families that I've already caught. Like, we have gold bats, so we're just gonna blow these guys away. Let's see if we can hit another blizzard.
Now, I think we'll only fight a couple of wild Pokemon around here before I start throwing around repels. And in fact, we just found who we're going to catch. We're going to catch Rhyhorn. If I don't kill him. I killed him. <laughs> I'm not doing so good, am I? Let's actually... Let's put Kenmore up front. Spin, and that's why. Now, what do we have over here? We don't know. What's that? It's a wild ditto. Dittos start out as normal type, but then they transform into whatever they happen to be fighting. So now Ditto is a Moltres, meaning it's Fire Flan, which means it doesn't like water. chance to catch him. Well, that's right. We didn't miss our, ch our chance to... We didn't miss our chance to get him. Rather, I screwed up our chance to get him. <laughs> That's enough playing with the wild Pokemon here. We're going to use a Max Repel. Not quite as effective cost-wise as using a regular Repel, but it works for what we need to do.
And thankfully our birds are nice high levels, so they'll keep the wild Pokemon away. turns into a really powerful, uh, Zapdos. <laughs> no luck. But we should be able to handle it. Send Olga out. I'm gonna try to blow him away with a bullet. Legendary and super powerful Mewtwo. Mewtwo is a straight up psychic type. With some very strong moves and some very high stats. That's why I brought along our powerful birds to help us out. Now 
That's all right, you get that defense up. Just means we're less likely to kill you at one hit. Yeah, that's the other thing. It knows recover, so even as we beat it down, it can recover its health. Psychic attacks. And look how much that hurt. start hucking Pokeballs at him. Now, we have 20 Ultra Balls. We have one Master Ball. The Master Ball will catch it immediately. I think we're going to save that for a last resort. We're going to actually try to catch him with Ultra Balls. Wish me luck. And we missed them all together. Pokeballs. Well, Ultra Balls. Yeah, we missed. Well, that light screen helped. Ah, oh, what happened? Did we... Have... Whoa, there you go! Alright, Mewtwo was caught! New Pokedex data will be added from Mewtwo. Mewtwo, the genetic Pokemon. Its DNA is almost the same as Mew's. However, its size and disposition are vastly different. Do we want to give a nickname to Mewtwo? Of course we do. The question is what? Alright, we got it figured out. I gotta figure it out, I just don't know how to spell it. We are all called Mewtwo Ubastis. Which is the name of the cat from Watchmen, but it's also a reference to Bassett, the Egyptian cat god. But that's it. We're all done. So 
we're going to get out of here, and we're going to pull it a, ga uh, a game. So thank you for watching, I hope you've been enjoying. Oh, did you think we were really done? No, I'm sorry, we have something else we have to do. There is one more very special Pokémon for us to find. But before we can find that very special Pokémon, we have to take a quick trip to the Safari Zone. Now we're just gonna wander right in. How you doing? So yeah, we're gonna pay the 500. Yes, I know, we gotta use special Pokeballs, we're gonna skip all this. Now, it's important for us to get into at least one encounter. And it has to be here in the Safari Zone. Doesn't matter who we encounter, or how. Actually, it might matter how. Oh, that's right, we were still being repelled. Wasted our money, but that's all right. And it's now time to take a quick trip to Cinnabar Island. Okay, we're at Cinnabar Island. And now we're going to start surfing. And it's very important that we surf right here along the edge of Cinnabar Island. Well, hello there, everyone. I was going to take the time to do a little bit of a uh, game glitch where we could catch a special Pokemon called Missing Number. But it turns out that it is not possible to catch Missing Number uh, through the normal methods in Pokemon Yellow. I didn't know this until I had tried to catch it. But what we will do is just get into a fight real quick so you can take a look at Mewtwo. Now you see uh, he's level 70 with 245 HP, so pretty powerful. And he's got a fairly useful, strong, normal-type move, a very powerful psychic-type move, and two utility moves that will recover its HP or put a physical barrier around it. And it easily crushes the tentacle. Now this time I really am going to say goodbye. Again, thank you all so very much for watching this uh, playthrough of Pokemon Yellow, and I look forward to playing more games with you all in the future. Take care of yourselves.